Wizards, Wizards, Witches, and Muggles. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing really well today. We are going to be diving into some Disney magic because I found some brand new mini brands capsules. If you don't know already, I love mystery capsules. I love mystery boxes. I love anything with a mystery. And recently, I found some new mini brands which I had never seen before. Ooh. Yes, I found some mini brands, Disney 100 edition. This is to celebrate the 100th anniversary of all things Disney. And of course, we're gonna open some of these. Now, I don't just have one of these. No, no, I've got quite a lot. I bought 10. So that means if we do the math correctly, there are five things in each capsule and we have 10 capsules. That means that we're gonna have about 50 mini brands to unbox today. So let's get going because we've got a lot of things to discover. And hey, if you are brand new here, firstly, hello, welcome. Don't forget, that you can click the subscribe button if you'd like to become part of our weird magical life help me <gasps> But let's go, because we got lots and lots of capsules to open. I'm really excited. I think these ones are gonna be special. Okay, so here we have it. These are the Disney 100 anniversary mini brands. There are 50 plus limited edition minis to collect. That's very exciting. Now these are quite special because I believe they're going to be silver ones that you can only get in the Disney 100 capsules. We have seen Disney Store mini brands before. Check out the playlist in the description down below if you want to see some of those unboxings. But yes, in here we are to expect Disney, Pixar, Marvel and Star Wars. So let's just dive in. Are they going to rip nicely? Oh, I always have trouble with these. Come on! Oh, perfect. That's it. That's all I... It doesn't help that I have false nails. Okay, let's try and, oh, oh, ooh. Can we talk about how holographic these are on the inside? Ooh, jazzy. Oh, that's just mean, giving two layers to open. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Okay, I forgive you because that was a really good pull tab. Okay, we are into our first capsule. These look a little bit different. They used to be like orange segments. <gasps> they have changed these up. They used to be like orange segments. They're now in packets. What? I don't know why this excites me more than the segments, but it does. Inside each capsule, you will get a collector's guide, which personally, I do not want to look at right now. We'll look at that towards the end. Let's move these and start with our first Disney 100 mini brand. These are in paper, which is quite cool. And oh my God, we started with a teeny tiny Disney 100 metallic special Chewbacca from Star Wars in this tiny holographic box. Now, these are made to be identical to actual toys that exist in our world in real life toy size. And these are just teeny tiny shrunken down versions. There's something so cute about them. I don't know why they're addictive. I don't know why they're cute to collect, but they are. That's a good start. Let's move on to the second one then. Oh, we have seen the normal edition of this before in a previous Disney Mini Browns video. This is Grogu in a tiny little backpack and it's a special silver one. I think they're all going to be silver in these balls. So there we have it, a little tiny baby Yoda. We're getting quite a lot of Star Wars ones. Okay, let's see what the third one is. <gasps> Kitty! <laughs> Aww. This one is so cute. This is Sully from Monsters Inc. And oh, I just love that so much. This is actually one of my favorite characters from maybe any Disney thing. I love Sully and um, oh, it's metallic. Let's take a look at the back of the box. Like you'll see that all the details are there with the barcode and everything. And these are all the others that you can collect in this series. That's so cute. That's my favorite one so far. Packet number four of the first capsule. This is something Spider-Man. This is a Marvel toy box and this is, it looks like a little Spider-Man car. We've got Spidey himself on the front. I have not seen the latest Spider-Mans. I've seen most of them. There's the little car and then you can see what it is on the back. I love how shiny and just special these feel. Okay, the last one of this capsule is, oh, it's a silver special baby 
Tinkerbell, which is so cute. This is part of the animations collection and oh, isn't that just divine? I mean, these are cute in their regular colors, but this is just giving extra cute because it feels all magical and holographic. That's really nice. Okay, that was a really enjoyable first capsule. That means that we're on to capsule two. That's not capsule two. <laughs> That's capsule one. <laughs> Okay, let's see what's in here. Oh, something new. We've got, oh, this looks cool. Is this from Avengers or something? I think it might be. Yeah, it is. It is a bow. Is this from, oh no, what was it called? Hawkeye? Is it the Hawkeye bow? I'm not sure. But either way, it's an Avengers bow. I'm not sure whose it's meant to be. I don't think it actually says, but it's a really nifty looking piece. Yeah, I think that has to be Hawkeye. The only thing that gives it away for me is the fact that it's purple and I have actually watched that series. So let's move on because we've got so many more to open. Oh, 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 it's Bullseye from Toy Story. That's such a cute one. I love that his saddle's all chrome and cute. Just to give you a look at the back, it's kind of looking like a stable, which is cute. I really, really enjoy the Toy Story ones and Monsters, Inc. What's in here? Oh, we've got a new one. I wonder how many dupes we're gonna get today. So this is Princess Aurora, very silver, super cute. This is the Disney Princess collection. They're like little Barbie dolls in their cases. They're very, very cute. I didn't realize all of these were going to be silver, but I kind of dig it. Oh, we've got our first dupe, just as I was just talking about it. We have a Chewbacca dupe. And this is the last one of capsule number two. <gasps> We've got Buzz Lightyear, just as I was saying that I really like the Toy Story ones. That's so funky. Like, ah, oh, Buzz Lightyear. <laughs> okay, I do believe we're on to capsule number three. Okay, let's start with this one because this one feels pretty bulky. Is it another, oh it is, it's another one of the baby princesses. And this is Ariel the Little Mermaid. I gotta say, I watched the live action of My Little Mermaid. It's not My Little Mermaid, it's The Little Mermaid. I keep thinking My Little Pony. Um, <laughs> I really enjoyed it. I was singing along, I thought it was beautifully made and I thought the casting of Ariel was absolutely beautiful. Her voice, can we just talk about her voice? Stunning. Anyway, this is a cute little baby animations collection doll of the Disney princess. That's so cute. I love that they've got a little sticker of flounder on the front as well. Don't even talk about flounder from the live action. They did him an absolute dirty. Okay, let's move on to another chunky one because, ah, oh, we've got another dupe. We've got another Spider-Man car. Let's open this and see what's inside. Oh, is this meant to be Flynn? It is. This is a silver Flynn rider from Tangled. I am overdue watching, like re-watching that. It's such a cute Disney film. Little Flynn rider. Ah, okay. Who is this? Oh, it's Toy Story again. And it's one of the little woo, aliens. They're so cute. I was actually just on FaceTime with my best friend, Rachel, and she had pajamas on that had these little aliens. And it said the chosen one. And it was really cute. So yes, this has reminded me of Rachel today. It's very, very sweet. I love that they've kept the green. I'll just show you the rest of the box. Super cute. This is Pizza Planet on the top as well. The last one in capsule three is quite a flat one. I think it's another Star Wars. Yes, it is. This is Princess Leia, which is quite cool. It says blaster included. That's so cool. And this is the Star Wars toy box. I'll just flip that around so I can show you the other characters. Oh, I hope we get Darth Vader. That would be really cool. Capsule number four. Okay, we're finally into capsule number four. Ooh, oh my God, this one's huge. Okay, we have to start with this one because it's absolutely massive. Oh, have they given us a, oh, they have. It's a Disney 100 shop stand. I forgot that you got these in here, but yeah, it's a little toy shop stand. Let's just go and build it, be right back.
and here we have it the little shop shelf so then you can get your toys and display them for all of your Disney 100 shopping needs let's move on okay oh it's a teeny tiny little oh protect the child yes this is a baby Grogu Star Wars sippy cup and it says protect attack and snack <laughs> <laughs> That's really cute. I've seen this one before in the full color. Okay, let's move on to the next packet. Right, let's dig in. Oh, it's another oh, Beauty and the Beast. We've got the Beast. We have got the Beast and he's looking so dashing in his shiny little cape. Here's the rest of the box, which is quite cute. Again, this is part of the Disney Princesses range. I guess they should call it Disney Prince and Princess range. Let's open this one. Ah, we've got another dupe. We've got another of the Toy Story Alien. And the final one of capture number four. Oh, it's a shiny little R2-D2. Oh, that's a really nice one to end this capsule on. Number five, woo. Capsule number five. Okay, this one is, oh, it's Spider-Man himself. So we now have a Spider-Man and his vehicle. Next up, we've got uh, some, someone else. Oh, is it another beast? Oh, it is. It's another dupe. Okay, and we've got another R2-D2. Oh, this one's full of dupes, this capsule. Okay, let's see if we can get something new inside of this one. <gasps> yes, my mum will love this one. It's Lotso Bear. The bear that smells like strawberries from Toy Story. Oh, look at him. He's so cool looking. He's so metallic. Oh, this one's going to be one of my favourites from today as well, along with uh, Sully from Monsters, Inc. That's so cool. Oops, dropped it. Okay, that made this capsule a little bit more worth it. Let's open the final one of capsule five. And oh my God, I tell you what, I'd start my own little alien army with the amount of these I have now. At least they won't be lonely. Moving on to capsule six that I nearly threw over there. <laughs> okay, capsule number six. What have they got in store for us? Okay, let's see what's in here. We've got something new. <gasps> is this a lightsaber? Oh my God, I don't even think I've seen the colored version of this. This is, it belongs, it's Yoda. It's, there's a little Yoda here. This is like full blown adult Yoda, by the way. This is his lightsaber. Ah, look at all that metallic, like holographic goodness. This is the packaging on the back. That's pretty cool. Zoom, zoom. That's my really bad lightsaber impression. Okay, let's. Oh, are you kidding me? This is our fourth alien. Okay, let's pray that this one is not an alien. It is not, but it is um, another baby Grogu, so it is another dupe. Okay, let's hope for someone new. Is it going to be someone new? Da, 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 da. Oh, no, it's another R2-D2. Hmm, the last one seems to have something... Oh, cute. They've made little metallic shopping bags. <laughs> Why is this so adorable? I mean, these were cute anyway, just the regular bags. But the fact that they've made metallic ones, look, there's Woody on the side. Oh, there's Ham. Ham is, oh, I just, I really like Toy Story, you know. Ham's one of my favorites and Rex as well. That's really nice that there's Buzz and Woody on the sides. And that's so cute. I love that they've made it metallic. Like how jazzy. Wait, we're on number seven already because they're almost full of dupes. Okay, capsule number seven. I would like less dupes this time, please. And I'm purposely gonna start with this one because I think this one is a dupe. It is, it's another Toy Story bag. I could tell by how flat it was. Okay, come on. Oh, it's gonna be Spider-Man again, isn't it? Oh, we've got another dupe, guys. Okay, this one I think I have a good feeling about, I think. <gasps> yes, I was right. It is Lightning McQueen from Cars. How cool does he look? There's even like a little driving wheel. I mean, that's pretty cool if that's a real toy that exists that you can drive Lightning McQueen around. It says full function control, so that's pretty cool. But yes, this is meant to be a six inch remote control car from Cars, which is very, very cool. Oh, the getting new ones are so exciting. Oh, she says, and she pulls another R2-D2 out. 
Okay, the last one of capsule seven is something new. Oh, cool. This is, is this a part of the, yeah, Disney princess range. This is the Disney princess camera. I think it's meant to be like a little Polaroid camera, but that's very cute and it's new and it's not a dupe, so I cannot complain. I guess that means that we've got to move on to capsule number eight already. Okay, come on, let's get some good vibes for capsule number eight. Let's start with this one. Is it someone new? Is it someone new? Oh my God, no, it's not. It's a dupe, but it's a really good dupe because it's of Sully. Okay, uh, oh no, this is new. This is a Spider-Man mask. That's a new one for today. Okay, oh, <gasps> it's a little Minnie Mouse phone. This is a telephone from the mini collection. Like how cute is that? It's got Minnie on the side and here's the telephone on the back. Oh, a little Daisy on the side as well. Like, oh. Okay, who's in here? Oh my God, so many R2D2s, aliens and beasts from Beauty and the Beast today. The last one in capsule eight, come on. Yes, we've got something from Mickey. This is the kitchen playset, which is super cute. It's got all the little pans on there with the little Mickey outfits, got Mickey on the side. The, that's very cute. I like that one, even though it is just a box and there is nothing inside these boxes either. Okay, capsule whoop, number nine. Right, capsule number nine. Okay. This is our second to last capsule. We're starting it with a dupe of the little telephone. It's okay, we've got four more chances in this capsule. Oh, we've got another dupe. It's che Chewbacca from Star Wars. Next is, oh, I think it's Darth Vader. It is, oh my God, look at that silver Darth Vader. That looks really, really effective. Uh, I love that they've kept the lightsaber red. I think that's so cool. That's a really good one. Okay, let's see what's inside here. Oh, that one just escaped me, but unfortunately it's a dupe. It's baby princess Tinkerbell. And the last one of capsule nine is <laughs> my favorite, Sully, which is sadly a dupe. Let's all take a moment, please, for the final capsule. Let's wish for many different ones that we have not received today. <sighs> okay, five more chances. Let's see who we get. Okay, let's open it. Mm. Oh, we got a, oh, we got Bo Peep. A silver, shiny Disney 100 version of Bo Peep from Toy Story. That's so cute. Okay, next is... Star Wars. Oh, it's a Chewy again. Oh, it's another bullseye. Okay, let's open this one. This is second to last. <gasps> We've got Princess Jasmine. I don't think I've ever had Princess Jasmine even in the regular Disney edition mini brand. So that's really cool to see. This is her box with Aladdin on the back too. And obviously this is part of the Disney princess range in their little doll boxes. Okay, this is the last one. Is it gonna be a dupe? I guess we're about to find out. Oh. Why am I nervous? Okay. Um, oh, we're ending. Weirdly, we're ending on, I think, the first one that we opened. So we've gone full circle. We've got another baby Tinkerbell. So let's take a look at everything that we got in today's videos and how many dupes that we got. So this here is the Disney 100 Mini Brands Collector's Guide. Let's take a little look at this together. So we've got the common ones, which I would have to agree because we definitely got a lot of number two and number five, which was the Alien and Tinkerbell. And then number, oh, these are all common. All of the, okay, we'll look at the rare ones soon. So all of these are common, which yeah, we got a lot of Chewbacca, we got a lot of the beast and r2d2 and sully so yes i would agree with the common ones let's see which rare ones we got so rare in here we got a few rares today actually we got bullseye a couple of times uh we got the mickey kitchen is there any other rares yes there are we got some spider-mans we got that oh and we did get ariel as well and princess aurora so the ultra rare which is very exciting we got the top three we got lots so we got the, the mini phone and we got the spider-man truck which is kind of cool i would have loved to have maybe seen princess tiana that would have been a really cool one to get as well as i think that's meant to be a silver stormtrooper oh my god look <laughs> this is like all of them being displayed 
Oh, and this is cool. So they have some iconic ones, which we did get a Buzz Lightyear, which is kind of cool. And then there's the Lux ones, which we were lucky because we got two of those. We got the Grogu backpack and we also got the Darth Vader one. Um, and these are all the bags that you could have got. I love the design of all the bags. And these are all the kind of different mini brands that you can get. They've got a lot on the go these days. And I knew that these capsules were different to usual. It says this capsule is made with certified recycled plastic okay so that is the cheat sheet now if I have done my maths correctly we got 29 individual pieces that we had not seen before today which means let me do some quick math that was 21 dupes that we received let's take a look at the dupes and these were the duplicates. So the most popular ones from today was Toy Story Alien, we had R2-D2, and we also had Chewbacca from Star Wars, and some of the Beast and Sully, they seemed pretty popular. But overall, I think we got a pretty good mix considering we had 10 capsules and 50 chances. Like, we got 60% individual ones that were not duplicates which I think is really good but I have enjoyed opening these let me know what was your favorite one that we opened today I've got to say these two are my ultimate favorite we've got Lotso Bear from Toy Story and we also have Sully from Monsters Inc I love 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 these characters and I think the metallic effect on them so nice so much fun. Leave a comment down below and if you got this far in the video, please do give it a magical thumbs up for me. It only takes two seconds. Make sure you're subscribed if you are brand new here. I make videos every single week and I will see you very soon in a brand new video. I'm gonna go open my own little Disney toy shop right now. <laughs> no, I'm gonna go find somewhere to put Lotso and Sully because they are so adorable. Okay guys, I will see you next time. Bye! Why are tiny things this cute though? Like, nobody needs this many Sullies. Um, <laughs> it's so fluffy, I'm gonna die. Okay, um, different franchise, but let's go with it.